Hi, I'm Juliana. I'm in Meridiella and I'm in fifth grade. Um, my question is, how are thunderstorms created? Good question. It's a great right? question. We get them all the time here. My answer was wrong. Well, no, your answer was good. <laughs> you know, talking about bowling up in the heavens yeah, and that's everything, right. right? Okay, so we'll get back to this in just a second. Okay. So stand by. All Don't right, let I'll... that spill because that's a lot of water Got and that'll it. be a huge mess to clean up. So, okay, <laughs> basic ingredients for a thunderstorm, guys. We need warmth and moisture. We have plenty of that here in the summertime especially. You need rising and unstable air and that allows the, the moisture to cool, condense, and then precipitate. Remember your water cycle, remember that? Right. So. Then you need, this is the most important thing, you need some sort of lift or a nudge, and that would be like a cold front, mountains, hills, or a sea breeze. We get those. That's kind of a mini form of a cold front. And then you get those ingredients together, and you get a thunderstorm. We're going to make our own little thunderstorm. Okay. So we help me bring this over? Yes. Let's bring this okay. over here Very... into the light. Okay, so imagine this water here. This is like the atmosphere. Okay. Okay, so this clear tub is our atmosphere. This right here is what we're calling our warmth and our moisture. Got it. Okay, so warm water, warmth, warmer temperatures are less dense than colder temperatures. Right. So okay. that allows things to rise in the atmosphere. So we don't have a cold front or a way to lift this, but what we need is that nudge in the atmosphere. So like a cold front or just the heating of the day when we get really warm during the afternoon, that's that spark that will launch the thunderstorm. Now watch this. This is hot water here. So what happens when we put this in, watch carefully. See how that red is rising? That's like how a thunderstorm develops. It's unstable air rising oh, up into the Earth's atmosphere. Got it. it cools, it condenses, it produces the rain. Eventually, it starts creating the thunder because of the ice crystals up in the clouds that creates the lightning. I love that. You can see that. Nothing it, here. It's, and it's, it's just like here. that yeah. billowing cumulus cloud and the anvil top, all that right there. Awesome.